Welcome back to Subsistence Hardcore. Well, it's day 19, I believe. And things have been going okay. Not like super great, super fast, or any of that. But we're surviving. We're doing okay. I just filled up the fire. We caught a lovely salmon throughout the night. And I should tell you guys, I am not feeling 100% right now. I'm, I got a bit of a headache. And so... I, I don't know. I, I wanted to get all my videos done for today. And this is the last of them, of the four series that I'm uh, uploading each day. And I gotta tell you, man, it's just it's getting tough to stare at this screen with this headache. But I'm gonna do what I can to try and get through without complaining too much or uh, getting myself killed. But fortunately, this morning, we're starting out, our food is looking good. We've got, I made up a few extra planks. We've got, uh, you know, we've got a, f a couple fillets to carry with us. And so I think I'll just kind of run around, do some gathering, and try and keep my nose clean. Not get in too much trouble. And we'll just see how things go. If the gathering goes well, we'll continue with the building. And that's that's kind of what we want to get to, is get the that little block base uh, going out there. The more I can build on that, the better. Now, I think I've got, like, one fishing tackle left after the fishing. Because it, virtually every night I do fishing. And um, it's, it's rare that I actually have enough food from other sources, enough protein at least from other sources, um, to not have to fish. So I have to make sure that I'm constantly getting grubs. Uh, that being said, I think I've got like 13 grubs out there, so we're not in dire need, but we do need lots and lots and lots of wood. So, again, that's part of the standard routine. Uh, the other thing I'm hopeful for is obviously nails, and uh, we will try for some small game if, uh, if it presents itself. I was, was kind of disappointed about the not being able to loot the one bunny that we were successfully uh, able to hunt. Uh, but, you know, it was just too high a risk. If you didn't see yesterday's video, that was, yeah, that was my first successful uh, bunny kill with the bow. Or with anything in this playthrough. Uh, but if there, I was just, there was wolves and bears like super close and there was no way I, I couldn't do it I just couldn't go over and loot it all right there's a wolf over there let's stay away from there look look we got a chest this is good uh, the other thing is obviously I need oh, another bandage so we got two bandages now that's good um, I need to find some you know what before I forget about it let's go ahead and eat one of these That'll pretty much top us off. Um, ammo. We need to find some more freaking ammo. And speak of the devil, here's an ammo crate right here. I think I see something over on that rock. Look at all those nails. That's great. Zinc is not like the most useful of the ores, but uh, you know, everything is useful somewhere or another in this game. Right. Yeah, look, it's 
looking pretty clear. I'm I'm kind of surprised. I I've become accustomed to running into so many wolves and bears. Every oh, there is a wolf. Let me just stop talking about it. I guess you know, just be grateful and not not like bring it up too often because. Like, I am not at all superstitious, but doesn't it seem, though, it's pure coincidence, but it doesn't it seem that when you mention something, then you're likely to, to see it? just cruise uh, you know I'm I think oh wow there's another bunny there I would like to try and shoot that bunny if I can just kind of cruise up until it I have no idea where it went to it would be nice to spot it though at a good distance and uh, maybe be able to try for another shot on one of those Okay, there, there it is. Okay, it's running again. I kind of saw where it went. Uh, damn it, it's it's gonna be out of my range or out of my line of sight. Yeah, yeah, I see that crate over to the right. Don't, just don't, don't start typing the comment. I know, I see it. I'm gonna get this. I just, I don't see where the bunny went. I'd love to be able to get it, though. It's just, I mean, look, all the ferns and the grass and the shadows. I, I can't, I, I can't see a darn thing in here. No clue where it went. And I won't, I won't notice it until it's until it moves. Oh well. Maybe we'll get lucky and find one on the beach area where I can actually see the stuff. But I want to get back out and fill the fire. Oh, yeah, I saw these bushes moving and I thought it might be a small game animal, but nope. over there, over there. Make sure there's nothing around me here. Alright, good enough. Let's swim out and see if we can find some kelp along the way. Yeah, I ate a couple pieces of kelp. I would like to keep my stockpile high. Okay, there, I see some over there. Let's go ahead and fill up the fire. Good. We got like 80 arrows. That's that's pretty nice. Or not arrows. Um, nails. Uh, but uh, I'm not gonna have room for the zinc. It's okay. Put the other stuff in there. This and this. Okay. Cool enough. Yeah, we'll make another... Where'd that kelp go? Is it still there? Yeah. We'll make, an, make another storage chest here pretty soon. Uh, okay, come on. Get that. I'm not going to worry about this... This stuff. 
I mean, the fact that our base is going to be out in the water like this means that we're going to have to... We're going to find so much of that stuff going to and from um, our base that I'm not really concerned about getting it. And, and frankly, it's, it's not going to be an immediate need, and we're not going to need that much of it, you know, to make the glass and, and that kind of thing. What we're going to need more of is ores, iron ore and so forth. So, But for now, I'm hoping we will find a whole bunch more loot crates. That would be nice, right? We did pretty good. I was, you know, I was debating, frankly, about making this video, you know, considering I have, I've kind of overdone it a little bit. And, uh, I'm still, like, debating whether I'll make a complete, you know, full day of it here, because I'm just, guys, I'm not feeling well at all. But I'm I'm determined to to not leave my viewers high and dry. You know, if you're enjoying this playthrough, I want to uh, make sure that you have content. So we're we're gonna forge ahead. There's a bear over there. And I see a wolf. Some of the wrong buttons here. Man, I really want to find a bunny. But it, if it doesn't happen, it doesn't happen. This area over here is as good as it was to find those loot crates around. Um, this is not going to be the area that I'll be successful at hunting. It's just too too many hills, shadows, and underbrush. But a lot of wood, and that's something we very much need. So it's good. situation. Uh, let's eat these kelp. It's going to dump our water down a little bit. Yeah, let's go ahead and eat a berry. And we may as well go ahead and eat up this other one before it goes bad. Yeah, we'll need the water. We should probably have drank some water while we were out at the base, but I don't think that's going to be a big deal for us. Oh, there's a bear over there. Let's stay away from that. Look at this. if I'm kind of lacking on kind of having an upbeat fun commentary I just I'm not I'm not feeling it right now guys there's a bear down there hopefully I can get this iron before the bear gets me okay yeah he's he's aware of us we just cruise this way. I'm thinking, let's... Okay, let's head up near the fence line. Oh, there's a freaking bear over there. Let's not go that far up towards the fence line. Just come this direction. We might be able to make it up near the fence. 
I'm not seeing anything down here. Maybe, oh, there's a bunny. And it's in a flat area. Without a whole lot of, yeah, as long as we don't run into predators, we might be able to get a shot on this bunny. Let's see how close I can get to it. And if it stops, come on, stop, would you? I got it! I got it! Look at that. It's still alive. Oh, God, there's a wolf. But we picked up the rabbit. We got the freaking rabbit. Our first success successful hunt and capture of a bunny. That's a milestone, guys. <laughs> That's a big deal for me in this playthrough. And another ammo crate. Give me some shotgun shells. Okay, not not shotgun shells, but it's fine. Everything's good. So yeah, if you didn't see yesterday's video, um, you know, when I, I got the bunny, I did give credit to a viewer who had kind of corrected me on where my aim was. I was not allowing for arrow drop, and uh, she was absolutely right. And uh, so I gave her credit in yesterday's video, um, and she has yet to correct me on the pronounced pook. I can't talk. The pronunciation of her username, um, I, I, I don't I don't even want to say it, the wrong name, um, but I've been calling her Karen, and uh, so I'll leave it to her to correct me if that's not how she wants me to pronounce her name, but uh, yeah, I, uh, the reason I'm bringing it up is, first of all, to give her the appropriate credit and to let all of you guys know that if you make suggestions, I listen. I definitely listen because I, I by no means claim to be like a master gamer, whatever. I play. I'm I'm like just I'm a gamer like so many of you out there who just loves playing the video, video game. Oh my god, that's No, 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 no. I just I love playing video games and I will never claim to be the best at it. Or, or any of that. Uh, some games I know pretty well, and some games not so much. But okay, we're safe. Um, but I like to also share the experience with other people, and and hopefully you know you can have some fun vicariously through my exploits, and that's the point. But uh, I like to have an interactive experience with people who do enjoy sharing the experience with me uh, to the point where look if if you're gonna make a suggestion uh, I'm more than likely going to take you up on whatever you suggest and and run with it you know that's part of the fun for me too it helps kind of make a, a new dimension add a new dimension to any game that I'm playing of like oh good well now I have some independent input that's going to you know maybe throw a monkey wrench into things maybe just you know help streamline the gameplay uh, make my gameplay better or worse <laughs> I don't know I think I guess it depends on the suggestion but so far so good my my viewers uh, by and large have been super helpful so I do appreciate it a lot My fire is still going, yay. Oh, and it's pretty close to being not going. Right, so, how are we doing on stuff here? Go ahead and eat that. Go ahead and drink this. And let's get back in the water a little bit. And then we can just refill this guy. Cool. Very cool. We're getting the stuff, guys. We're getting the stuff we need. Uh, well, 
I don't have any ores in here. Huh, I thought I had been gathering ores, but apparently not. So now I'm just going to have to carry them around, I guess. But that's cool, too. We're just going to head... Here, let's pop this off one more time. And how's our sun? Maybe we can take one more trip out. And uh, surprisingly, uh, considering the way I'm feeling right now, we've made it through. Not too many problems. I I was worried that like I wouldn't notice things. I'd, I'd be distracted. I wouldn't. My attention level wouldn't be as high as it should be for this mode of gameplay. And I I'd, I'd end up making a, a dreadful error that would just end the playthrough. And, you know, that would be a uh, insult to injury or injury on top of insult or I, whatever. It would be doubly bad because not only do I feel bad uh, playing, that would feel awful to, like, end the game, the whole playthrough on such a sour note. But I should stop talking about that. Because it's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. Everything's fine. Would like to find a little more fiber, though. Because we're getting a lot of wood here. We were pretty successful with the nail situation. And now I want to make sure we have the cordage necessary to do more building in addition to um, making some more uh, fishing tackle. Because... I've, I've used up quite a lot of it. But for now, I think we're just going to hit up these trees around this area. Gather whatever pops up. And then head back out. Because there, is, I do start. I'm starting to sense. Uh, oh, that, that bunny! It wasn't we weren't even remotely close to it? And look at it, it's off and over the hill. It's gone. Yeah, I don't want to tempt fate though. I feel like we've done well. Yeah, we've done well, and I don't want to press the issue too much today. There's a wolf over there. Yeah, that that's our cue. We'll just head away from the wolf. We'll see what we can see on the beach. Oh, look, look. Another building crate. We have found so many building crates today. And more nails. And a ready-made plank. I'm so happy with that. You know, I've been saying, oh, well, we're not finding them, but they'll come. Um, you know, I know I, I played so much of this game. I, there's no doubt that you're going to run across everything you need eventually. It's just not always right there what you need, when you need it. But today has worked out well. We've gotten what we needed. So, I know there's a wolf over here somewhere, but there's also that fiber that I wanted to get. I just get nervous. And I know there was a predator in the area, and then I don't see it again. Yeah, that's, that's making me uneasy. Alright, well, I don't see any more plants spawning right here on the beach. The sun is getting a little low in the sky for me to go out very far. So let's go ahead and just swim for some kelp. We need that. We'll take a look around. Is that 
up on the side of the rock, and it looks like it's just a shadow, but we'll take a closer look. You never know, maybe it's a kelp growing in the shadow. No, it's not. Check around the front side. Nope. Nope, not seeing it. And that's fine, though. As the sun sets, we will come up here and we're going to butcher up this little rabbit. We're going to have our first little rabbit steak. That'll be yummy. Eat one of those. And these don't take very long to cook at all. And look at how much wood we've got. It's great. We've got, you know, 87 there. That is really good. Let's put away a little bit of this stuff. So I've got 39 planks. We picked up. We can make a few cordage here. Got quite a bit. You know, oh, if I split her, it's gonna drop it. So let's split that in half. Like so we'll leave 16 in there. We'll make a little more cordage here. And then we'll make more planks. And then let's grab our food that we'll eat up our bunny meat and we're looking great so yeah I've got tons of stuff queued up we're gonna be able to do a lot more building I'll get another crate going for us uh, we'll see about relocating this and, and building up this platform more around like I'm gonna extend it out further um, be interesting to have whole thing like surrounding this rock you know have extended out for three we'll see we'll see how big I'm gonna go on it is this two or one, it's one. all right whatever uh, for now though I think we we had a quite a successful day and uh, d uh, despite some trepidation on my part about how this is going to turn out and I think turned out quite nicely and so I'm pretty pretty pleased so if you like it, please smash the like button. Leave me any comments, tips, tricks, recommendations. Send me well wishes. That would be very nice. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. And we will talk with all of you again very, very soon.